multiply this volume drilled pipe and power and power in barrel by the pump output from the data sheet in barrel there strong same, same like uh, the cylindrical leg up this barrel it comes with this barrel and it will have uh, strokes the leg up the leg in, in strokes now this question will be number two so as you see leg up was calculated leg in was calculated in strokes in strokes first step calculate the volume then divide by the pump output again calculate the volume in the angle and the uh, pipe divide by pump output again calculate the volume in the annulus volume of mod in the annulus then divide this volume by pump output calculate the volume in the drill pipe and drill color, because they have different dimensions, drill pipe and drill color, then divide this volume by pump out output. You will get the theoretical lag up and the theoretical lag in. Equation one and equation two. Here we will have uh, assumption that the theoretical leg gain is equal to the actual leg gain. Why? Why this is different from leg up? This consideration is different from the leg up. With the leg up, you have a communication between the mud and the formation. So either the mud can get to into that formation. In, which is a, which uh, case is called loss of circulation, or the formation fluids get into the mud, and this is uh, uh, a kick or uh, uh, a blowout. But we are not in the case of a kill uh, of a, ki uh, a kick. It's just part of the walls of the uh, uh, walls of the uh, wellbore is dissolved, part of the wall is dissolved into the mud, get mixed with the mud, wash out, this is called wash out. 